Hey! One last video. I'm still Joy, and it's still Wednesday, August 27, 2014. It is 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and I am pooped. I am too tired to so sew anything from this point forward. Thank goodness I have all three garments done. My jacket that you saw on me this morning, my little daisy top, which is just a plain cotton top, and now I finally finished my dress. It has to be washed because it's still got all the uh, dozens of marking pens that I use uh, inside it. So I've got to wash all those out and then press it one more time. But this was Sure Fit Designs. You know about Sure Fit Designs. It was one of the tops that I had made several blouses out of. And all I did was extend it. Now, I was nervous that it was going to be too tight for me and it fit me like saran wrap, so I extended it too much. I widened the sides out too much and I didn't like it. But very easy to take it in in fabric once you get it made. So, that's what I did. It's got waist darts in the front, waist darts in the back. Everything, of course, that was in the blouse is in the dress. It's just longer. Very easy. So, last video for the day. I'm going to hurry up and upload it, and that will be three for the day. And then I'm going to go out and sit on the swing and throw the ball to Jackie. Okay? One more time around. I have a line. Remember, I lined it. The lining stops right here. I just lined it to the knee because that's only how far you need it. And I have never put lining in before, and I love it. Remember, I had the zipper in already? and I read all these things on how to do a lining in a sleeveless dress. You cannot have the back seam in, and you cannot have the side seams in. All you can have is the shoulder sewn if you're going to put a lining in a sleeveless dress. So I took the zipper out, took the side seams out, put the lining in, and I am very happy that I did. Anyway, that's all I want to show you today. I'm going to go play with my dog.